welcome and welcome back to my channel Lamonica's lab so in today's video I'm going to be doing another wig review this video is in collaboration with Sam's Beauty so thank you so much Sam's Beauty for sending me another wig to review here on my channel so I'm going to be showing you guys this gorgeous bob because spring and summer is around the corner honey so it's time to you know keep our protective braids in and put these bobs on or these wigs on and keep it moving out the door this is the studio cut invisible deep part wig it is a invisible or incredible natural look hand tied curved part i have it in the design angle wave and it is in the color 1b and the stock card looks like this this particular wig is heat resistant fiber curling iron safe up to 360 degrees fahrenheit so if you want to see how i apply this wig and how i slay this wig then Keep on watching. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up for more wig reviews. And let's get into this wig review and tutorial. So it comes in your typical box. Constructed with two wig combs in the front on the side of your part. A wig comb in the back and adjustable straps. Now, initially taking this out of the box, it's super lightweight. And the bob is really, really shorter than I thought. This is really shorter than I thought. But this is the parting. It's not a lace wig, so it's just an invisible deep part. If you guys can see that. So let's see what we will have to adjust. The parting space off the break is pretty, pretty decent. The parting space. But let's see what it looks like once we <clears throat> try everything on. Alright you guys, so this is what it looks like on the side part. Um, I don't know you guys, you guys let me know down below, but it's certainly not big head friendly. I have a big head, this is not big head friendly. Um, it's super, it's like super thin. Like I feel like I'm missing hair. But this is what it looks like in the back. And then this side, I don't know. This is what it is on the side part. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be middle part. I guess you could put it in the middle, but I chose to do it on the side because it just looked crazy in the middle. I just added a little bit of my MAC NC43 Studio Fix Powder just to give it more of a look. And I added some got to be glue on my edges just to, because it's certainly not fitting all over my head. But, so that's the, that's the cons. It's not big hair friendly. It's kind of really, it's like thin, like it's not a lot of hair on the unit itself. And the parting, you may have to pluck it. I probably will pluck it later once I see if I want to put it in the middle or not. But for right now, I just added the powder for the sake of the video. So those are the cons. Now let's get into the pros. The pros of this wig is the curls. Like the curl is super, super cute amazingly gorgeous like look at this like the cut these curls the way that the bang piece goes in the front is really really cute definitely one of those wigs that you have to like play around with and like fluff it out it's like i said it's, it's not that much hair on this unit so to fluff it out would make it look like it's much more fuller but i do like the bang piece in the front it's super super cute the hair is soft it's not a um, shiny yaki, but it's kind of yaki, yaki feel. But this is how the wig looks. I think I'm gonna cut this part right here so that it can match this part. But the waves are really, really cute and the bob structure is really, really nice. So that is everything that I have to say about this wig. So if you like wig reviews, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. 
let me know down below what you guys think about this wig if you saw this wig in rotation or here on youtube before let me know what you guys think or suggest i should try to do i don't know let me know down below i'll also have the wig information linked in the description box of where you can purchase this wig to try for yourself for this summer and all of that good stuff like that so until next time i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys